All right, guys, today we've got 2023 Houston. We're going to do this as a live commentary build, similar to what we did with the video before the last video. Um, 2023 Houston, the track, I have it pulled up here on the right side of a different monitor I have. And the track, I mean, it it's, I don't know. It's pretty standard, but I don't know. It, it could be pretty cool. It has a really big set of whoops on it. So if you're not, you know, really good at whoops this might affect you it does have some sand and whatever so we're gonna try to do it live you'll probably see a bit of track building some testing and then the final finished track at the very end i've just i've done it so many times you know because i keep restarting because it just doesn't work out and then three jump space jump um space jump jump and then we have this extra stuff in the corner i know that sucks but i don't know how else to do it but this is gonna be mega 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 annoying because this corner is so big we can't i don't even know how you would do it I mean, I guess we just put in some of these every so often. So let me just see what we got. Hit the bridge. Okay, works okay. Okay, I mean it's a bit small, but it will work. And then we would come into the sand, which works pretty good. Minus we can't get off the start here, right here. Hmm. Now we have a step on, step off, triple, double probably or triple you know there's a bunch of speed off of that i could see a quad what would that be then quad well i don't want a quad quad single so it'd be a quad triple double probably let me see let's see what we can do so it would be jump here one two three then the table. Okay. One, two, three. I haven't tried any of this, so we should probably should try this, right? Instead of keep building. Okay, then that'd be the step off. One, two, three. Jump. Jump. One, two, jump. One, two, three, jump. One, oh. It might work. Okay, so we hit the first turn. No problem. Hit the bridge. Okay. Step on, triple. Okay. Let me hit the double finish. Pretty easy. Okay, the sand works okay. Huge triple. Oh, whoa! Whoa, that could have been so much bigger. Okay. Oh, that works. Works pretty good. Woo! Let's go. That triple in is pretty tough. It really is. The triple out, not so much, but the triple in is pretty tough. No way. No way. That works. 
No way. I'm looking at it. There's no way they hit that. I'm going to delete all of it. Because I don't want people, if you if I validate the track, to to cheat this. So what I'm going to do is make it a whoop. And I know it probably shouldn't be. Actually, let me see. What exactly is that? Is that just a half jump? But let's try it. So this definitely isn't my best track ever. For sure it is not the best track I've ever done. This big empty space is annoying, but, you know, it is the way it is. Jump onto the table. Step off triple. Now, the rest of this is pretty easy. Really easy to overjump. Same with the Supercross triple. That's very, very easy to overjump. This Supercross triple. So we hit it in third. Just about right. Good. Whoa, there we hit the triple, triple. Jump out. Now this part is sketchy. Okay, that works. That's the way we hit it that time at least. And then the whoops. I mean, that's pretty much it. It's a very simple track. Very simple track. I may try and redo it. <laughs> because I'm not happy with that big space. And boom, there you go. Is this better? I feel like it is better. We still have a decent amount of space in between here, but I don't know how else you would do it because the way you have to connect the track back to itself, plus we have the bridge, I just don't know. I mean, we could have brought it in maybe a tiny bit, but it just kind of feels like no matter what I do, we're gonna have this weird spot here in the middle. And even the track map, I mean, I'm looking at it. The track, it isn't really straight. It, it's not like lanes of straight like we have here. They kind of point down and point up. So the top lane should point down. The bottom lane should point up. But I made it more straight. So, But even on the map, they have a you know some space here. So I feel like this one looks better. Maybe you see it. Maybe you don't. But let's try it out and see if it is better. Okay, so we got the start. Simple. This is the same. Very similar. Easy to over jump, but it works. This is better, for sure. That feels better. This feels better too. Way better. Not so not as big as the other one. Oh, easy to overjump though. Bit of an overjump. We're okay. Oh, barely. Nice. Feel good about this. Nice. That works a bit better. This track is better. I feel like it's better for sure. You know, it took what we know from the first track we have and incorporated it into this one. Ooh. My frames are like lagging. What the heck? So that first section is basically the same as it was. The, where it gets more different is like all of this is better. It's just better. More fun to play, more compact. This is still very easy to over jump. And we under jump this time. I just can't win. Oh. Oh. Oh my gosh. What the heck is going on? Dude, what the heck is going on? These tough blocks are. Freaking my bike out. 
Dude. Dude. I just want to get back to this side. Try and hit this again. We didn't even get it. All that work for nothing. Doing donkey whips here. Okay, so the other way we could hit this is if we slow up a bit. Okay, that works really good too. It's a bit slow, but it works. It works pretty good. Pretty happy. Pretty happy with the track. I just wish it we didn't have all that space out in the middle, but... You know, let's put FanFest in here. Let's put FanFest on the track, during the race, in the big open area. It'll be so cool. But yeah, this is 2023 Houston. One thing I do want to say, I don't know if I pointed this out or if I put it in the video, but our thumbnails have been determining the winner. We put the winner. We put Tomac for A1 and San Diego. He won. We put Chase for A2 on the thumbnail. He ended up winning. Roxon we used for Oakland, so when that race comes, maybe Roxon wins. I don't know who we're going to put on this one. I used Tomac because it was a live commentary, but maybe I go back and I think Anderson is definitely close to getting a win as well. So we'll see. Really crazy night of racing, but I do feel like Webb is on the verge of a, of a, a victory here. So let me know in the comments what you guys think, but you guys and girls are absolutely amazing. Thank you so much for the support on the channel lately. It really does mean a lot. And until the next video... Take it easy.